word problems with directed number. For example, the temperature overnight was negative 8 degrees Celsius and it then rose to 11 degrees Celsius during the day. What was the change in temperature? Some questions will ask you for what the change was. Someone, some of the questions will ask you for what the new value is. This one's asking for the change in temperature. So when they're asking you for change, the steps to find change is do a sum of largest minus smallest. You've still got to allocate the correct integers, the correct directed numbers. So the largest value here was 11 degrees Celsius and the smallest was negative 8 degrees Celsius. So you'll do 11 minus negative 8. It's not 11 minus 8 because you're doing the largest value minus the smallest value. Largest minus the smallest of negative 8. So that will be 11 minus a negative is plus, plus 8, which is 19. And then you have to say which way the change went. And include units. Sorry, there's people investigating the heating ducts upstairs, I think. So you say the temperature, now it was negative 8, that's pretty cold, and it rose to 11 degrees. So the temperature rose or increased by 19, and we're in degrees Celsius, so you say degrees Celsius. So when it's change, it's largest minus smallest, and make sure you get your signs right, and then write a sentence where you say what the change was, whether it was up or down, and what the units were. A lift is at the second floor, and it travels down five levels. What floor is it on now? Now this isn't a change question, this is what did we end up at? What floor is it at now? For these, you'll just write a sum. Based on where it started. Now the levels is a bit weird because you can see, let's, let's write this, it's at the second floor. That's floor two. It travels down five levels. So this is two take away five equals negative three. So then you have to interpret with a word answer. What does floor negative three mean? It's at floor negative three. That's basement level three. Remember the basement levels are floors below ground whereas the second floor is above ground. So we can use the negative to mean floors below ground. So you say the lift is at basement floor three. A diver is at two meters below sea level. So below sea level would be negative two. They move up one meter, then dive another eight meters, diving. Going down is minus. Going up is plus. How deep are they now? This is where are we at now? So it's the same steps. Write a sum and interpret the word answer. Where do we start? We start at two meters below sea level. We start at negative two. They move up one meter plus one. Then they dive, that's going down another eight meters. How deep are they now? Start at negative two, 
add 1, we're at negative 1, take away 8, negative 9, and we interpret it with a word answer. What does negative 9 mean when we're talking about sea level? They are at 9 metres below sea level.